Leanna turned away from the photo of her mother and stared at the ceiling. She blinked back to reality when her cell phone rang. She looked at the caller ID inside. What's up, Wayne? I just called to see how you were doing. How'd you get my number? Nana gave it to me. I told her I had to call and apologize. Apologize for what? For upsetting you last Saturday. You didn't upset me. Yes, I did. No, you didn't. Yes, I did. You're upsetting me now. What are you doing tonight? Eating a gallon of chocolate ice cream. Have dinner with me. Uh, I, I don't think so. Why not? Because I don't, I don't, I don't want to. You scared you have a good time and forget about Rob? Ron. What? His name is Ron, and no, I can never forget about my fiancé. He's not one of those insecure brothers, is he? Where do you want to go? To my favorite restaurant. The Golden Corral isn't a restaurant, it's a buffet. I say tomato, you say tomato. It's still a vegetable. Actually, it's a fruit. The Golden Corral? No, silly, I'm talking about the... I know what you were talking about. Back to what I was talking about. What time are you coming to pick me up? I'm already out front. Hurry up. I can't hurry up. I have to get ready. Get ready? This isn't a date. We're just going to go grab something to eat. You know what? I think I'll pass. All right. You win. I'll splurge and take you to the olive garden. Save your money, Wayne. I I really don't have much of an appetite. You just said you were about to eat a gallon of ice cream. Trust me. I'm not going to be very good company. Whatever. Don't try to make me feel guilty. Hello? Hello? No, he didn't just hang up on me. Fine. I didn't want to go out with him anyway.